Hi, I'm Nick Timms, and I'm a second year international relations major. And I'm Erica Berry, and I'm a senior economics major. Welcome to this tour of Pomona College. We're starting right here in Marston Quad, the beautiful green space at the heart of campus. It's the perfect place to show off our sunny Southern California weather. On warm sunny days, most days that is, you'll see a lot of students out here studying under all of the trees. Sometimes, in fact, you'll see an entire class out here on the lawn. And since we're right at the center of campus, it's a great place to get oriented. Just at the edge of the quad, you'll find Bridges Auditorium. That's where lots of big name speakers and entertainers are here. Performers like Dave Matthews, Larry Wilmore, and Taylor Swift. And on the other side of the quad, we have our Carnegie Building, one of many academic buildings in this part of campus. Look north and you'll find Smith Campus Center, the center of a lot of our social life. Beyond that lies North Campus, where a lot of juniors and seniors live, and past that lies the rest of the Claremont undergraduate colleges. And look south and you'll see one of our truly iconic buildings, Bridges Hall of Music. Beyond that is South Campus, where all of the first years live. Nick's going to take you there next. Here on South Campus, we have a row of residence halls, primarily reserved for first and second year students. Here's one of our three dining halls, Frank Hall. Side note, they have amazing omelets. Right next door is Mud Blaisdell Hall, where I live. It's also where I serve as a sponsor for a group of 18 first years. So come on inside. The residential experience for first years here at Pomona is centered around the sponsor program. The small groups of students who live with student sponsors who are here to support them and make sure their transition to college life is easy. Sponsors like me are here to help them get their bearings and fit in and be there whenever they need some friendly guidance. Here's my room. As you can see, it's a single. About one third of the freshman class will have singles, with the other two thirds having doubles, and you're gonna have the occasional triple. While we're here on South Campus, let's check out our International Center, Oldenburg, where you can live in a dorm with students who only speak Spanish, or French, or Russian, German, Japanese, or Chinese. You can also have lunch here at one of our language tables, where you can practice conversing in almost 30 different languages from Arabic to Vietnamese. As you can tell, living here on campus is great. But let's go check out some of the places where you'll be taking classes. This is the Studio Art Hall, which is kind of a work of art itself. It's full of amazing spaces for making art, whether you want to major or you just want to dabble. Next door is the Seaver Theater Complex, where you can watch some incredible plays, or maybe even act in and direct one yourself. You remember Bridges Hall of Music, right? If you love music, you'll probably spend a lot of time here, either listening or performing as a member of one of our many ensembles, from choir to Balinese gamelan. Plus, you can take music lessons in just about any instrument you can think of, and the lessons are all free. Here we are in Pomona's Science District. The buildings here are equipped with state-of-the-art lab equipment, and since there are no graduate students on campus, undergrads have the opportunity to do original research with our professors. This is Millikan Laboratory for Physics and Mathematics, the newest building on campus, and one of my favorite things to do here is go to the new, beautiful, immersive digital planetarium where you can just kick back and look at the night sky. Speaking of looking skyward, tucked in between Lincoln and Edmonds Halls is a permanent art installation called Skyspace, done by world-renowned artist and Pomona alum, James Terrell. The light show that occurs here twice a day at sun up and sun down is kind of mind-blowing. But it's also kind of nice to just sit around the little infinity pool and study. Now I mentioned the Carnegie Building earlier. It is one of the most recognizable buildings on campus and houses our international relations, politics, and economics programs. As an econ major, I spend a lot of time here. Right next door is the classic Stanley Academic Quad, home to the humanities disciplines and also home to the oldest academic building on campus, Pearson Hall. By the way, this is one of a number of fountains that you'll find here on campus. And on your birthday, you may find yourself taking a dip in one. This is Haldeman Pool, where water polo and swimming and dive teams compete. Pomona and neighboring Pitzer College join forces to offer 10 varsity sports for men and 11 for women, and they all have great facilities on our campus. Of course, you don't need to be on a team to enjoy our beautiful Olympic-sized pool, and you don't need to be a varsity athlete to enjoy sports here at Pomona College. We have tons of five college club team opportunities and intramural sports. If you're an athlete like myself, or a sports fan, you'll probably find yourself spending a lot of time on the east side of campus, where all of our athletic facilities are. Here we are in the Rain Center, where you'll find everything from two basketball courts to a wider range of workout facilities and classes in Zumba or fencing. This brings us to North Campus, where I live. 
Here we are in Prairie Dining Hall where you can have a slice of pizza or a bowl of cereal under a priceless work of art. This mural of Prometheus bringing fire to humankind was done by famous Mexican muralist Jose Clemente Orozco in 1930. We like to compare Frary to the famous dining hall at Hogwarts from the Harry Potter series. It does have that kind of magical feel, doesn't it? Surrounding Frary are the residence halls where most of the juniors and seniors live, often in suites with three or four friends. This is Dialinus Hall, one of the newest dorms on campus and home to many of our seniors. Come on upstairs and I'll show you around. Here we are in a shared living space. Many seniors live right here in suite arrangements just like this one. I can say from experience, life in a suite is pretty sweet. And finally, just north of the Pomona campus are some of the buildings that serve all five of the undergraduate colleges here in Claremont. This is the Hanno Mudd Library, which has over two million volumes, not to mention a really cool coffee shop. So here we are back where we started on Marston Quad. We hope you enjoyed the tour. And we hope it whets your appetite to learn more about Pomona College. Come for a real tour and it'll be our pleasure to show you around and answer all of your questions. See, See you, you soon. soon.